Gordon. Security scanners, chemical sniffers. Hmm. The United Colonies sure isn't taking any chances. Artı baktı shuttle. Ja, for jeg skal gjøre en sånn der... Jeg skal gjøre en mission. Sånn test mission for de Vanguards. Vänta, vad? Blev det markaren plötsligt ett annat ställe? Vad då? Den var ju där uppe. Mast net station. Ja, ah, han <laughs> ah. Lite bugga markers kanske. Vi ser en sammenheng, please select en listement. Boom. By joining the United Colonies Vanguard, you agree to perform necessary services for the United Colonies that you could place that could place in serious danger, resulting in harm to your craft or yourself, up to and including death. Ho ho ho! Agree. Okay. Story, bro. From their foundation, the United Colonies strove to provide all their citizens with opportunity, security, and peace. But there were those among the UC that still wanted something more independence. So in 2161, the UC issued the Centaurus Proclamation, granting UC citizens the right to settle distant worlds and form their own sovereign powers. It wasn't long before the first new faction, the Free Star Collective, was formally organized in 2188, later followed by House Rule, revealing themselves to the universe in 2230. I've never seen Så klart er de religiøse ekstremister. Colony war between the UC and the 
Freestar Collective. Set off by the unauthorized Freestar colonization of Vesta's Pride in 2308, a direct violation of the Nereon Treaty, the colony war spread quickly across the galaxy. Both sides deployed every tool at their disposal. Armadas of warships, mechanized combat platforms, or mechs. Even bioengineered alien creatures. Ooh, aliens? You see Xeno weapons. It was only in 2311 at the Battle of Cheyenne that the scales finally tipped. The Free Star Collective, utilizing their civilian fleet as a human shield, successfully crippled the superior United Colonies Navy. After their shocking victory against the galaxy's greatest navy, the Free Star Collective offered terms of peace, which the colonies, out of an interest in staving off any further human costs, accepted. The galaxy has been rebuilding ever since. The colony war was a horrible conflict that irreparably ruined the colony war. A different kind of tragedy struck the UC city of Londinian. Londinian? Newly constructed but critical supply center for the United Colonies war effort, Londinian found itself overrun by one of the galaxy's most mysterious predators, the Terramorph. Oh, oh, fun. The red button. Det er litt sykt da. Alien. Men jeg ser det at den har litt sånn munn inni i munnen. Det er sånn... Ja, det er jo aliens. Filmen da. United Colonies of Space. I know my rights. Joining 
to get themselves on their feet. Vad är glöden? Cool, okay. Da. Knock history. Knock history for the dog. Det er modeller av skipa. I've spent a fair bit of time in simulators just like these. They're startlingly realistic. Have fun. Okay. Ah, you must be our new applicant. I'm Proctor Samuelson. The simulator's already been prepped. You can head in whenever you're ready. Fall to give some area expertise. How about you just mark me down as a pass and I head out? Vanguard assignments can often include both space and ground combat. It'd be bad for both you and the United Colonies to not ensure you're adept in both capacities before sending you out on your first real assignment. Hmm. Got an advice? Well, I can't answer that question directly. I will say this. Due to the solitary nature of our work, resourcefulness is a critical tool in any Vanguard pilot's repertoire. You're permitted, even encouraged, to use whatever tool you're able to find in there. Okay. Of course. You'll be running through a high-realism combat flight simulation, engineered by members of the UC science staff, right here in MAST. Your task is to defeat at least three tiers of simulated opponents. Accomplish that, and you pass the exam, and can then proceed on to your probationary mission. That's a dollar to steer over. Three tiers of enemies. Your required enlistment time for citizenship will be reduced, and your enlistment bonus increased. But you're welcome to try as many times as you like before returning to Commander Tuwala to proceed on to the next step in your application process. We'll only keep the highest score you manage to achieve in there. Okay. The simulator is designed to be a near-perfect replica of a Class B Deimos hoplite. Ah, I think I'll just yeah. So, exit. Just head in whenever you're ready. Yeah. This is the Mark 18 flight simulation chamber applicant, currently in orbit around a high-detail recreation of a remote world. When you're ready to begin, please take a seat in the pilot's chair. Your exam is simple. Defeat as many tiers of opponents as you can before your ship is disabled. You must defeat at least three tiers of opponents to pass the exam. Good hunting, applicant. Oh, I can't just do this like that. For all, like that? No. I will have. I don't know. Grab it, you grandma. Oh. Nära vass. Snakker om dritt av meg også, da.
motherfucker. Føles faen meg ut som det sitter i et skip, og det er helt sykt, ass. Tenkte at dette er VR, liksom. Fy faen. Fuck, yeah, okay. Hold on. Okay. Shield offline? Oh, man. Why? Oh, I shouldn't let me go to share, yeah? Restart Control computer yeah. Faen altså Jeg er nuba Restart Let's do it. Simulation reset. Prepare for your first opponent. New targets active. Jeg føler jeg bare må være kjapp til å drepe dem. Jeg tror det er alt som har å si. Oi! Fuck. De hittar mig som fan, jo. Simulation 
reset. Prepare for your first opponent. De hittar man så jävligt, vad fan? Vad? Follow. Fan. Sker här. Jag driver och prövar att gräda det men det är ju fan mig omöjligt då. Ah. Är det nog gott att låta köra skepp ass? Nöttemix. <laughs> nice name. Mm. It's late night Starfield. Prepare for your first opponent. Okay. New targets active. Oi. Lyden var et faktor som skjedde i stedet. Shield offline? What? Ja, få regn i sikte da. Faen, han fyller opp salvet sitt igjen. Får jeg ikke hila mer? Ja, da dabba jeg igjen. Fuck, altså. Fan, ikke break, ja, ass. Ok. Nå. Nå er det faen meg nok her. Åh, hadde du resettet sånn at jeg bare trenger å drepe en av dem? Det er litt noob-friendly, det da. Nei, ok. Da er det to. Nå er det nok. Han blir helt svimmel, jo. Hvor er du enn? Hva er det? Nå. 
Nå er det nok, ja. Jeg tror jeg greier den nå. Oi, jeg er low. Faen meg bra jeg så det, ass. Jeg prøver den til, men hvis jeg feiler, så er det good enough, ass. Jeg kommer aldri til å bli noe... Bli noe jævla... Pilotmester, ass. Fuck it. Ok, vi greide det. Det får være bra nok. Congratulations, applicant. You've passed. Nice. You can head up to Commander Tuwala to receive your final results and your probationary assignment. Or you're welcome to take another run at the simulation. No, thank you. If you'd like to try and earn it. I've never been so glad to drive a car. More than a backup car. Shoot and... Eye. I wrapped up my pelting exam. Ah, so these are your numbers that just came through then. You ready to hear how you did? Sure. Make a snappy times wasting for me to be earning some credits. Excuse me for keeping you waiting. Let's get to it. So, looking at the data, checked out a few of the murals. Good. A test of preparation and thoroughness. Two traits the Vanguard values highly. Psychological results are all within expected levels. Navy doesn't have room for folks that'll fall apart the first time they're trying to outrun a homing missile. Now, how'd you do against your foes? All right, clear tier three. We try to set a high bar, but that's no small feat. Nice work. Hell of a job. I might even let you fly me around sometime. So then, looking at your results as a whole, and presuming you're successful in completing your probationary mission, you could have your UC citizenship after only... 10 years service. Better than your average lab rat or diplomat, but pretty standard for folks going out into combat. 10 years might seem like a long time, but Bug. it's worth the climb if you wish to become a citizen. So, sounds to me like we've got Vanguard material on our hands. If you're interested, we could bring you on as a provisional member today. Get you the credits you've earned, then send you out on your probationary mission. All right. First, though, all UC service people, provisional or otherwise, are required to swear an oath. So, you want to make this official? Commit yourself to the cause of the colonies? Hey, click, come on. It's a big decision. John, 
You're not about to have my compatriot here sign some kind of contract that sells you their grandmother five years down the line, are you? Officer's honor, Sarah. This is honest work for honest credits. So, you ready to do the deed? Yeah, can we do this under the table? You're not in the Freestar Collective here. Vanguard keeps its work above board. You want in, you have to do the same as everyone else. That starts with the oath. I don't know. I understand. It's a big decision. Think about it. Come back when you're ready. Mm, har, har du it's been a long time since I've been to Mars. Soul system doesn't get a lot of traffic. Uh, whatever. I about to turn those nuts. Everything squared away. Vanguard still come around then. Ready to start your journey towards becoming a full captain in the UC Vanguard? Sure. Fantastic. Then just follow me. A role play walk. Vectera, by Vectera, by Vectera! I can't believe it! I thought I had won the other fan guy. Really, really, you. Oh no! Down from oblivion! Bane of the fleet, constellations shining, star of stars. <laughs> Get away from me, you weirdo! Oh, you must have me confused with someone who isn't your number one fan. <laughs> There's nothing weird about that. Although for a second, I didn't even recognize you. Shame on me. But now that I know it's you, what are the odds? And to think, I almost went for coffee instead. Da, you han kan fra oblivion. I changed my routine for one day, and here you are. It's almost like it was meant to be. Uh, yeah, I was just minding my own business. I was minding your business as well, visualizing it, dreaming it, and tending to it like a garden in bloom. And now here it is, our first spring. Either way, it's such an honor to meet you. Cool. Hey, do you mind if I follow you around? Do you need a sidekick? What am I saying? You're a hero, of course you do. Oh, I forgot to choose again. Fan, I was quite sure that I chose the other fan guy. Oh, that was a bad idea. Yeah, leave me alone. Or? You can certainly give him out later. I'll take him. Hmm, Manage your crew. Change your assignment between the ship and outposts. Different crew have different skills. Which enhance your ship or outposts. Okay. Sure. Okay. Right doing this where we couldn't see the stars. Now, raise your right hand. The motto of the Vanguard is Supra et Ultra, above and beyond. That is where we serve, beyond the furthest reaches of the United Colonies military, and with honor and duty above reproach. Do you swear to protect and defend the citizens of the United Colonies to the best of your abilities, and to uphold the values of the Vanguard? Honor. Loyalty, self-reliance in all your actions as a member of the United Colonies Navy. Hmm. I'm not normally big into commitment, but for you, fine. Yeah, that I like it. I guess I'll take it. Then let me be the first to officially welcome you to the United Colonies Vanguard. Now, only thing left is getting you that probationary mission. And what I've got is. And the legal shit, let's think, can't you? Group trying to refurb an old colony war processing plant on Tau City 2. Sounds like they'd barely gotten set up when their communications died. 
place is as isolated as they come. So Brass wants a vanguard to deliver the repair suite and ensure anyone present is safe and secure. So, okay. can the people of Tau City 2 count on you? Hey, I'm getting paid, right? Sure. Oh, that's the spirit. Head down to the space. I hope to watch on Mutanaras. He'll get you the repair suite plus your new recruit kit. I like to go over a deal and all that, actually. And so I reckon with that that there. Jeg vet ikke om det er sånn, hvis jeg velger de her, så kan jeg ikke velge andre type guilds eller sånn. Jeg vet ikke om det er sånn. Social. Hva er det vi har her? Craft? Nei. Pickpocket targets? Nei. Ok. You can force a target NPC at or below your level to flee. Below your level to flee. Det er mye greier, ass. Bribery? Det er litt nice. Jeg tar den ned. Boom. Ok. Da... Skal vi ut på en ferd. Er det... Grunt work? Det er den. Ja, det er UC. Ok. Da er vi i gang. Jetpack? Jetpack? Wait. Bindings, Brina. Jetpack? I say no jetpack. Whatever. Man blir litt lost på planeten her, ass. Endelig så kan jeg bevege meg ut herfra. Altså, det er gøy med story og sånn, men man vil jo skyte litt ting også, da. Cool. Jeg må skille opp sånn at jeg har litt mer oksygen og sånn, for jeg merker det blir litt lite det jeg har nå. Er det Mario? Manifest says we're fitting you out at one comms repair suite. In addition to the standard issue welcome kit all probationary pilots get for their first mission. Med packs, some small arms, couple spare ship parts, all the essentials in case of any surprises up there. My people will have everything on your ship before you lift off. Won't even know they were there. Hmm. So, paying a visit to the people of Scenic Tau City 2. Scenic Tau City 2. First job. Just keep your head on swivel and you'll come home safe. Any questions before you head out? Nah. Okay, though. Anything you tell me about Tau City 2? I honestly didn't realize it had people living on it until we got your record. Report they gave us seemed clean. No known hostile outposts. But I wouldn't say that's permission to let your guard down. 
Just watch out for wildlife and pirates. Keep those med packs handy and you'll be fine. So long as they got uh what exactly that pretty much too dangerous, if that's your concern. The repair suites mostly just wiring and circuit boards. So long they got or share run to sheep or tatting or drepting, so I regret. For that to that prack. I'm all set. Let's go. And I won't keep you. Make us look good out there. Tell me, Mario. What? What? Ah. Inaccessible. Also, I can't even hit the hard axe ship mid. Shunner. Ship mid, I'll abort it. Captain Tim. All right, let's get this crate into space. Where are the supplies? Some brought them now. They're there, pa. What? Burn caps. I sit there on the idiot. I try to keep your ship clean at all times. Let me know if you want to talk some more. Ain't got time for no talking. Time to be killing. Uh, take off. Need eagle oxen. Vi får se hur jag börjar skjuta på de skeppen där alltså. Ja, så är det med att vi ska jumpa. Back to system. Galaxy. Okej. Okay. Var ska vi än då? Där ska vi få ta oss ett i. Power up grab drive or the uh, uh. <laughs> a little cult. No my have liberal controls for shape of the skarma. Scan. En måned her også. Det er ikke noe mer enn det stedet der. Land. Ja, det var det jeg visste at jorda er helt ubeboelig i det spillet her. Sikkert blitt sånn som Venus eller noe. Exit ship. En abandoned meat packing facility, built on the fringes of the settled systems. Jeg vet hva som skjedde. Iron. Okay. C 
See if they've got any weapons or ammo. Friends. We get a flood diving it out. Something's been through here recently, but left everything in place. <laughs> At least we know it was. The Crimson Fleet. Oi, come on, value. Rescue X. But how man so nearly kill me? Yeah, that was the skill up now. Er den på fire, er det ikke det? Jo, der er det. Er det noe crafting? Er det ikke noe med... Jo, her. Vet du, får jeg ikke satt på... Jeg må binde... To sekker, jeg må binde noe våpen. B... Sånn... Jeg må ha den hagla der. På to. Jeg kan ta opp, det var tre damage bare da. Laser rifle. Rare rifle. Ja, vi tester den. Det er sånn P90 eller noe der. Den har jo til og med 50 skudd. 100% P90. Hvorfor får jeg ikke putta på flashlight? Da har jeg på meg den drakta der. Ja. Nice. Jeg synes det var litt rart at jeg bare gikk med sånn civilian outfit der. Og da kan jeg... Der er jeg, ok. Nice. Oi, hva faen er det? Trilling rigg. Jeg bare tar med... Sånn. 
Da er det et eller annet monster her. Hello. So what do we got here? A rear. Clean to be one of the settlers, or a pirate. You see on patrol, maybe. Can make my day if you said you were a shock trooper out for a stroll. Hmm. Yep. Vanguard, huh? Lite folk som ser på. Hahaha. Åh, fyff, Anna. Du tre folk. Hvor lenge jeg streamer i dag? Eller sånn... Hvor lenge jeg streamer... Når jeg startet, liksom? Sånn... På Twitch? Generelt. Jeg streamer på Justin TV med Halo og sånt, men jeg har aldri vært sånn tryhard streamer. Det er mest venner som ser på, egentlig. Jeg kan ikke tro. That a terramorph did all this damage. I mean, I've heard the stories, but to see the terramorph there's on that monster, some alien. Kind of normally we're talking here. Terramorphs have a unique growth cycle. They're usually only found on worlds. I've been to stream a third witch. But Tau said he's too young to have one. Yet here it is. I came looking for an explanation and found. All this. I'm not exactly equipped to deal with a killer alien. Nah, nah, nah. Sounds like you could use my help. I sure could. Because to confirm my suspicions about. Ah, no, are the other folk? That's the friends of mine now. They must have seen them. This is. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm doing. Det er hyggelig, da. The admin terminal's here in this building, but it needs its connection reset. And as I found out, that's not a one-person job. But if you can make it to the security outpost and restore the connection, I think I can get things back online. See if the settlers left us any other tools. Okay. Jeg må fighte en jævla alien, liksom. I came here to help some sellers not play chew toy to some alien. Uh, okay. Where can I find this it's security the outpost? It's in the middle of the facility. The terminal in there should allow you to grant me access to the system as a whole. Then we can see about getting things back online. Okay. Let's do it. Good. Once I see the connection reset, I'll get things underway on my end. Take care of yourself out there. And make sure you leave enough of that thing for us to get a sample. Det kan jeg ikke love deg. Så. Det er Starfield også da, det kom jo for ikke så lenge siden. Så det er sikkert uh, noen folk som har lyst til å se hva, hva det innebærer. Det er forståelig. Her er Ganske nice så langt, ass. Det er litt mye sånn menuing og sånt som jeg ikke liker, men uh, utenom det så er det greit, egentlig. Amp, det er sånn healing, da. Kan jeg åpne deg? Expert! Ja, det får jeg ikke åpne, naturligvis. Folk må følge den og subbe. <laughs> Det er bare å beholde penger, men jeg uh, kan godt få det, det er nice der. Jeg streamer med CS, egentlig. Men jeg skal streame dette her, da, og legge det ut på YouTube. Uh, jeg er litt sånn hobby-youtuber. Hobby er det noe mer her, tror jeg? Ja. 
storage crate där det är er sån master. Ikke sant? Fan va? Varför kommer det ett sånt steg jag kan öppna ting på liksom? Är er det meningen att backtracka, I guess? Her er det noe trøk jeg har vært. Ja, det her jeg skal uansett, så. Faen, da må jeg gjøre... Da, da må jeg begynne å skille opp i sånn at jeg kan drive og åpne ting, ass. Fordi det er jævla kjipt å komme til steder som du ikke kan... ...gjøre det på. Hva skal jeg her? Reset security connection. Uh, I'll make this quick. Hmm. Plants turrets took a beating, but I should be able to get you a couple of kill lanes. Just get the thing to chase you down the alleys between the buildings, and you'll lead it right into a crossfire. That shoot graphics. I wish I found this earlier. You notice those sensors around the facility? I'm gonna check how many wait are. Okay, I'll let it go go far. Part of a livestock tracking system should let you keep tabs on how close the terror. Er det her? Ah, her. Ok. Uh, turn on. Ah, hvor er det jeg skriver inn det? Der, ja. 183.1. Er det ikke det? Nei. Point five var det. Sånn. Bare deg her nå. Det er sikkert bare bots. Sånn. Oh boy. Den ser jo helt sinn... Oi, ok, det er ikke bare en. 